Another way of making a toy move is by using the motor to make it wobble instead of to make part of it spin with a wheel or spin with a fan you can use a wobbler. So you build your structure it works well if it's um, stable when it stands up so it needs to have at least um, at least three legs maybe four legs um, you can make the legs of corks or sticks or even even markers but it needs to be able to stand up well by itself and not fall over easily and then you hook up your circuit with um, batteries and a motor you can add lights if you want to you need to have a switch so check your motor works then um, Here's a few of different ways of making it. This is an, an eraser. Uh, push a hole in it with a paper clip and then push the axle into that hole. And then when you hook this up, the motor will spin fast. And um, because the eraser is on unevenly, it's going to really wobble. Woo, there we go. It wobbles very hard, enough to make your toys skitter around the table. Um, both of these things are designed to fit onto the motor, these little pulley wheels and the fan. So you can use that to your advantage. You can stick it in and then um, I've seen kids do this by gluing, um, gluing a marble to one of the to one of the fans. So hot glue a marble on to one of them. You can even cut the others off or you can put this one on and glue a little stick on it and put a marble or something something weighted on it so that when you turn it on it'll spin, the weight will spin and it'll create this jittering motion.